the key legislation that underpins the use of promissory notes and remittances is the Bill of Exchange Act 1882. It's a good idea to become familiar with this statute as it says that the Bill of Exchange, once tendered, has to be treated as cash and goes on to describe what is required to constitute a valid Bill of Exchange. I promise to pay the bearer. It's a promise backed by the belief and trust that is, it is a real form of money that gives it power when in reality it's just a piece of plastic. Only 2% of the entire money supply is through promissory notes. The other 98% is digital and within the Bank of England's fractional reserve system.